What's good everyone, it's MJO23Dan back with another video. Today's video we have something special. Yes, it's a brown box, it's not your traditional black box. This right here, my friends, is the Air Jordan 1 Cactus Jack. All right, so we have the Air Jordan 1 High OG Travis Scott SP. Probably means special project. These retail for 175. Style number is CD4487 and color code is 100. Color on the box is Sail Black Dark Mocha. All right, so a good friend of mine by the name of Civic Kid 96 you guys can follow him on Instagram and Twitter. You can follow him for Funko Pops, sneakers, overall collecting, you name it. So this is the paper that is included with the Travis Scott or Cactus Jack Air Jordan 1s. You got a pink paper with his logo up on there, Air Jordan Wings logo and Nike Air. You open that up and you get a second layer of the white paper and then you have the shoes. All right, so the Travis Scott Air Jordan 1s. The big, big thing about the shoe is that big old swoosh right on the side. It is backwards, yes. I think that is one thing, and in, these are our initial thoughts here for you guys on YouTube. Uh, it's just something that like really gravitates people, I suppose, with the big old swoosh. It's right there in your face, you guys can see it. The only thing I felt that was missing from the shoe, maybe I'll name a few things too, is this empty space right here. And I feel like they could have done a lot more with that. I mean, when you're putting a big old swoosh backwards and you have empty space there, it's, it's gonna say something about that. But the shoes also come with five different laces, which I thought was pretty ridiculous because you got the black ones that are in there, you got the mocha or the chocolate ones there, the pink ones, the cream ones, and the red ones. All right, so another thing that I like too is this ribbing on the back side. You know, a lot of people know that this is a Velcro back. You guys can open it, it's a stash pocket. It actually exposes a red piece right inside, but it goes all the way up inside the collar. And I feel like there was one thing that they could have done different as well, is that if you wanted to expose the red lining on the shoe, open that up and you can actually flip it down, which I felt like would have been something that the style would have shown for. You got the Nike Air on the tongue. You got a white insole with red Nike Air on the heel. You got Travis Scott's Cactus Jack branding right there on the side of the tongue. Traditional Air Jordan Wings logo right there on the collar. It's got a cream midsole, white and mocha up top, chocolate on the bottom, and a bit of his logo on the heel. So I wanna say like two weeks ago, this shoe was going for about $2,000. A week ago, it was going for 1500 Now, it's going for less than 1000 In fact, I think on StockX, you can get them for about 850 in my size, size 10. Um, pretty sure there's going to be differences of prices all across all sizes. So if you guys are interested in purchasing this shoe, you guys can hit the links down in the description and go on StockX and check out whatever size you need and go from there. So there's a whole bunch of different retailers that are going to be having the shoe not only in the u.s but internationally as well i think in the bay area it is dark side initiative so if you guys are in the bay area i'm not sure what their raffle or release procedures are but definitely like hit up their website give them a call 
This is not a paid sponsorship by them whatsoever, but I just thought I'd mention it if you guys are in my area. In fact, a few days ago, there was a line over at Undefeated. I think there was also a line over at Union in LA and they had an opportunity for people to purchase this sneaker via raffle so you actually had to get a raffle ticket and have an opportunity to purchase this shoe and from all of social media if you guys have been following social media at all there were a bunch of fights that broke out over this sneaker which you know me nearing 40 years old i don't think i should be out there banging with all you other kids i'm not sure if it's going to be relatively easy getting on sneakers or at your other local mom and pop shops or anywhere around the country or the world but i don't think you guys should subject yourself and put your guys in in a position to you know fight over things like this it's not worth it there are other sneakers in the world you guys can go after i'm definitely going to be trying on may 11 which is the release date of or the worldwide release date of this sneaker uh, and you guys can try and have your opportunity at this the quality is good I felt like the leather is pretty much what Jordan brand usually puts out in Air Jordan 1s nowadays. Um, I do appreciate that it is an OG high. I'm not really, I'm still not a fan of mid-cut shoes. Um, I do like that there's Nike Air on there and then they have the Cactus, Cactus Jack branding on the tongue. Um, but I still feel like they could have done a lot more with it. Last year, 2018, you guys remember the Mocha 3s. I also did a recent video on this. You guys can click the card up above if you guys want to see a review on it but basically I think if they put a Cactus Jack logo or branding right on the heel and really nothing else with the shoe it would have sold just like this so you know regardless of whether it's like a backwards spoof, it's it's really a hype thing to me shoot I mean if they can invert like the jump man on there or make it look somewhat silly <laughs> I mean they could really cater this to the to the youth here but um again it's it's pretty much like the same colorway of the mocha 3 so anyways let me know what you guys think in the comment section below again it's mjo 23 dan uh subscribe to me on twitter instagram youtube and facebook um again shout out to civic kid 96 for letting me have a look at the travis scott or cactus jack air jordan ones let me know in the comment section what you guys think about the shoe overall. Is it something that gravitates towards you? Uh, what do you think about all the laces? Uh, what do you think about the colorway? All that. Drop it down in the comment section below. You guys can also check out my website at mjo23dan.com. Follow CivicKid96 if you guys want to take a little bit more of a look on the sneakers itself. And I will talk to you guys later. Take care.